I'm Madison Weil here at Mountain View School. Just one campus possibly affected by layoffs as San Diego Unified School District tries to close a nearly $94 million budget gap for next school year. I was just caught so off guard, I, I literally felt like someone punched me in the stomach. Lisa Riley is currently the only kindergarten teacher at Mountain View School in Logan Heights and tells us she recently received a notice that she was laid off. As a kindergarten teacher, you know, we do much more than academics. Like we love them, we teach them how to treat others. She says the news spread through their small school quickly. Even some of her former students emotional. I mean, a first grader, why are you about to cry? I heard you're not gonna come back. And then it made me cry because these are students that I pour my heart into. The district tells us they are doing everything they can to minimize the impact on classrooms, cutting things like software or supplies wherever possible. However, at Mountain View, a small Title I K-8 school that serves many lower income families, teachers say any cut feels significant. With the flooding and just the economic situation in this area of town anyways, Families want security for their children. Holly Hellerstead, a middle school teacher in her first year with the district, says her contract wasn't renewed for next year. I think it's a lot of confusion and a lot of sadness. A sentiment echoed by parents. Oh, it's devastating. Our school is already pretty small. Like this father with three kids at Mountain View, joining families countywide, calling on the district to find another way to come up with the funds. Just seems like there's other things that they could do. Madison Weil, ABC 10 News.